in under two minutes, I'm going to show you the quickest way to reduce your CPU temperature, in my case, up to 11 degrees Celsius. On the screen that's showing right now, that's Prime95 program. So that stresses the CPU to the maximum, producing the most amount of heat. On the graph, you can see the green line that's kind of sporadic, that's jumping up and down all over the place. That's called thermal throttling. So it's been activated multiple times. Uh, when it's activated, what it means is your CPU is, knows it's running too hot. So it backs off its speed. And uh, when it's backing off its speed, less speed equals less heat that way. So, and you can see the temperature for the CPU running Prime 95 that's staying around 90 degrees Celsius. That's freaking hot for a CPU. Generally, you want to stay around 80 degrees Celsius. Now, I'll show you a quick way to reduce your CPU heat. So on the bottom right of the screen, open up your power options. And once you're in power options, select your change plan settings. So go ahead and click on that. And once you're in this menu, select change advanced power settings. And in this menu here, scroll down to you see the processor power management. Open that up and go into the maximum processor state. Select that to or change that to 99% and apply those settings. So here's the results for both comparisons right there. Uh, on the left side, you got to see 100% CPU, that's 90 degrees Celsius. And on the right side of the screen, the CPU is running at around 79 degrees Celsius. So in general, 11 degrees Celsius cooler. This is effectively reducing your overall CPU speed. On the left side of the screen, with the thermal throttling issues, you are, well, the computer is running at 2.7 or 2.8 gigs anyway, uh, because it's running too hot. On the right side of the screen, it's about 2.5 gigs. This works perfectly well if you don't need that amount of processing power or perhaps play games with very light CPU usage. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good day.